In this video, we are going to cover the fourth biggest raw feeding mistake in our raw feeding mistakes in 2019 playlist. So let's get started. And really quickly, you guys, in the comment section below, let me know if you made this mistake. And of course, subscribe and click the bell. All right, you guys, here it is. The fourth biggest raw feeding mistake here in 2019, in my opinion, is getting tunnel vision, resource, mentor, whatever you want to call it, tunnel vision, okay, where you only look at one resource for information. It's bad. You're missing everything else out here, okay? Once you get past the transition point, you guys have already heard me talk about this in a previous mistake about using too many resources to get started. This is the exact opposite, where in that stage, you want to pick one thing so you don't get overwhelmed and confused and frustrated. <clears throat> but once you get through the transition, you need to branch out. Okay, you can't just pick one piece of information. Okay, there are even people that I don't necessarily like in the raw feeding fresh food com community whose stuff I've looked at because I think that's important. Okay, so do not, do not, do not, do not pick one source of information and use that as the, I, I don't know, the holy grail of information and everyone else is wrong, okay? And question stuff. If there's something that you're like, hmm, I think I may have read something different somewhere or saw something different in another video, go and review it, go and investigate it. It might be one of those things where it's not right and it's not wrong. It's was it right here or was it wrong here? I mean, there's so many different variances. So whatever you do, number four, biggest mistake, do not make it, is getting resource or mentor tunnel vision. I mean, even at the end of my Raw Feeding 101 course and Raw Feeding 101 book, that's the last thing I tell people is, <clears throat> okay, you're on Raw Feeding now, you've made your transition, you're super cool and awesome, but what you need to do now is go keep learning more. And not just from me. There's tons of people to get information from. There's Kimberly from KeepTheTailLagging.com. There's, of course, uh, Ronnie Lejeune from Perfectly Rawsome. There's Rodney Habib, Karen Becker, the two crazy cat ladies. If you have kittens, there's Rachel Fusaro over at Bones & Co. who knows tons and tons and tons of awesome stuff about keto diets, who also has a YouTube channel, and I will put her right here. But the point is that there's tons of resources. Do not just use one. If I had just stuck to one piece of information, one person to follow, one book or something like that, I would not have uh, gotten to the place where I am now. Okay, and I'm still learning. You know, I've gone through the Dogs Naturally uh, Raw Dog Food Nutrition Specialist certification process. Now I'm going to be moving on to another level and uh, getting the Cassie nutritionist certification as well. There's always more to learn. Please do not make mistake number four. Do not get mentor or resource tunnel vision. And check out rawfeeding101.com for all your raw feeding training needs. I'll see you guys next time.